Go for it. What's the harm? As you know, my heart fluttered for Philip Reilhardt back when we both served Redania. One day, I doused myself in fragrances like a whore in a heat wave, put on a pinstripe doublet, they make you look slimmy, you know. And I went to her, told her, Philippa, with so much in common, and so on. You know what she said? Pinstripes haven't slimmed you down enough. No. She said, Geralt, turn around. Not in the mood for jokes. No, I'm serious. Turn around. Triss? I thought... So did I. But I changed my mind. Thank you. I'm grateful. Dijkstra, no offense, but... Leaving, already gone. Let's go somewhere. I know a spot where we can watch the ships. Lead the way. They're safe now, right? Yes, you can stop worrying, really. Oh, you're right. Just hard to believe it's over and done with. I've dreamt of this moment for months. This how you imagined things? No. I imagined I'd be on the ship with the rest of them. And you'd be on shore, waving a handkerchief, maybe. I hope you don't regret it, that things have gone differently. Well, they say Kavir's lovely this time of year, but I prefer you. <laughs> Not surprised. I'm pretty lovely this time of year, too. I won't disagree. We might still go there one day, when it's all over. I don't know. Kavir seems so far away. End of the world, really. Hmm. Maybe you're right. So how do you envision our future? I'll be Grand Master of the Order of the Flaming Rose. You'll be High Priestess of Melitale. We'll live happily ever after, a horde of kids around us. Oh no, won't get out of it that easy. I asked you a serious question. Where do you see us? I mean... Let's say, five years. Don't know. No idea, honestly. Trying to weasel out of answering again? You rascal. No, it's just, instead of dwelling on the future, I'd rather live in the moment, like we are now. I miss this Geralt, you know? Meaning? Not a Geralt who's not afraid to open up to me. Tell me what he really feels. What he wants. What I want? <laughs> One more thing. Shh. I know.
Look, they're signaling us. It's a message. H L A K B R Hol Lakba. It makes no sense. It's code. What did you expect? Thank you, Geralt, for this, and for what you said at the port. I should have said it long ago. So, what happens now? Afraid it's a... I've got to find Ciri. I'm close. I will find her, or someone who knows what happened to her. Where will we meet? I can only think of one place where both witchers and sorceresses are welcome. Care more. Haven't been there in a while. So, I guess I'll see you, witcher. I'll miss you. A lot. I'll miss you too. fragrance, acrid sweat, and chestnut balm for aching joints. Dijkstra. Ah, those witches' senses. Can't hide a damn thing from you lot. Same seems to be true for you. Will you ever leave me alone? Someday, sure. Once I no longer need you. <sighs> Dijkstra, what are you plotting this time? What would you say? How many mages did we say, all together? Dunno. Didn't count. Thirty, maybe, give or take a few. And how many would you say remain in the north? How many alchemists, healers, herbalists? Two thousand? Three? Doing a population count? Is that it? No, I'm concerned. In Novograd they had us, we were here. But who saved those in Rimba, Banard, Ard Kareg? Gullet. You know damn well that daft bastard Radovid won't rest till he's killed them all. Every last one. Yennefer and Triss included. Moving as speeches go. Now get to the point. Why are you telling me this? Because I want you to help me kill Radovid. I don't kill kings. Just not a regicide. Rumors to the contrary be damned. I know. I'm merely asking for your aid in organizing the assassination. Someone else will strike the blow. <sighs> Dijkstra. Might not have heard this, though I'd find that hard to believe. But witchers are neutral on principle, so... Oh, bollocks. That's a convenient excuse you lot try to hide behind every time the temperature rises. It's grown hot, my friend, and it grows hotter still. Pyres burn in every city. For majors, great and small, your female friends included. For non-humans, for witchers soon. Is that the North you espouse? The North you're prepared to live in? Silence. Cards close to your chest, I understand. To slay a king, it's not exactly some bloody necker contract. You think on this. Think on what I said. And if you conclude you'd rather change the course of history instead of riding its current to hell, you come find me. At the Passiflora in the Garret. I'll be waiting with my maids. I'll think about it. So long, Geralt. <laughs> 